And looking for homes, ponies helping to find a cure for a common horse disease. Laminitis, or foundering, is a costly, common and incurable equine disease. For some years, a team of Australian researchers has been searching for the causes and a cure, and they've been helped by a herd of little horses. Now, the ponies need good homes. These little horses are at the peak of health. They're cheeky, they've got all their own little personalities. But they're all prone to a potentially deadly disease. Laminitis, a painful hoof condition also known as foundering, is the second biggest killer of horses and currently untreatable. Many horses have to be put down if they get the disease and it gets to the severe stage. So it's devastating. Until five years ago, the cause was uncertain. Professor Martin Sillens heads the team that proved high levels of insulin were to blame. In horses prone to founder, like little Coco, sweet feed triggers toxic levels of the hormone. We, uh, we lock them up and restrict how much they eat. The groundbreaking research led to a joint multi-million dollar project by the Queensland University of Technology, the University of Queensland and Melbourne and Charles Sturt Universities. We've been looking at different strategies to, to get insulin levels down in horses, to identify horses at risk of the disease, to develop diagnostic tests and also uh, develop novel ways to treat it. They found methods of predicting disease risk and a reliable diagnostic test. And some of the ponies were part of a clinical trial using human diabetes medication. The drug company work looks really promising. It looks like we've, we might be close to uh, a preventative treatment. Now 40 of the ponies need new homes. The horses have received the best of vet care while they've been in the program, so they're in great condition. Now the researchers are looking for some pretty special owners. A lot of our ponies are perfectly healthy and have no problems at all. And then on the other side we have ponies that are, have metabolic syndrome and are prone to laminitis. And in that case we need really caring, diligent owners. And there's a small adoption fee. Researchers can be contacted via their Facebook page, University Pony Adoptions. Cathy McLeish, ABC News, Brisbane.